It's Mom and Pop Video Shop. Welcome to Mom and Pop Video Shop, and certainly welcome back to our now more than 500 subscribers. Tyson, I don't know about you, but I want to say thank you. We, we I think the last time we did a thank you video was at 250. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, something like that. So we didn't want to do that thing where like every time we did a, I don't know. Yeah. I, every time we do a hundred subscribers, we weren't gonna put out a thank you video because not only would that be old for us, I'm sure we'd get old to you guys like, yeah, we get it. Great, you got another hundred, good for you. Uh, but I think five hundred is a good milestone number. I think that was a good one. I agree. And we're just the next uh... video you get will be a thousand. If we could get to a thousand subscribers, I and mean, we're still a very itty bitty channel, obviously, but we appreciate every single person who has taken the time to hit that subscribe button because, um, you know, you don't have to. And I realize that, you know, yes, YouTube is free, but it's not free when it comes to your attention. So you pay with your attention, which has a lot more value than I think a lot of people give it credit for. So I absolutely. Know I, yeah. Is, is there anything? You know you what? It's almost kind of poetic. So I look at this as like uh, back in the day. Mm -hmm. a true mom and pop video shop in a little bitty town, you know, mm -hmm. that like maybe starts with this new idea of memberships ah. for the folks that come in and rent, you know, like that's how you look at it. It's like, you know what? We've been around for a year. We've got over 500 rental members. Yep. Now. So I think that a, a thousand is a, is a good target to, to have for the next one, but no, I'm, I love this stuff. I mean, and I gotta be honest too. It's um, it's never felt like work. I guess that's more, just mm -hmm. patting you on the back you know this is uh, i've always had fun with this and uh man i even though i know what's coming um i always look forward to the videos that uh that drop too because um <laughs> if if folks don't know this uh i am not as technologically savvy as joel is so i don't do i'm just the talent folks i'm I, i'm <laughs> and, and what a I'm talent good looks, you are what a talent you are my friend i'm the good looks <laughs> And the talent, uh, I work best in front of the camera. Yeah. Uh, I need my coffee to function. You know, I'm a yep. typical bougie celebrity, but uh, Joel does all the editing, all the behind the scenes stuff. And that's what I love to see because it's, you know, I never know what little clips and inserts and laugh tracks are going to be on each episode. So uh, I enjoy it, hopefully, just as much as, as you guys do. But uh, that's my very long, convoluted way of saying thanks so much to all of, you know, the 500 and whatever we're at now 13 i think they left it this morning yeah uh, yep. but 500 plus of you that have that have stuck with us over the last year and some change and and you know seem to dig what we put out and as long as joel and i keep having fun with it and you guys yep. keep digging it we'll uh we'll keep doing it yeah this all just started as a way to have fun um and as far as the technical side of things go i'm just technically savvy enough to be annoyed by the technical technological deficiencies <laughs> <laughs> that I'm trying. So my goal is over time, you know, because when you first start something like this, you don't want to over invest financially. Cause you're like, Oh, well, if we did it for like two weeks and we've just dropped five grand or something ridiculous, you know, to, to do exactly. oh, get the best camera, the best, this, and then you're like, eh. so I've, I've always subscribed to the, uh, it probably also he heavily stems from my coming from a micro budget filmmaking background where you start with the, the minimal that you need, the minimum viable, items and and equipment to get the thing rolling and so for instance uh we got a group of videos coming up in september that we have hopefully fingers crossed i have improved the sound issue because up to this point we've been using like these uh, relatively cheapo wireless lab mics i got off amazon and they're fine but like i'm noticing like i'm, at, I'm going through our august videos and i'm literally they, they do this weird like like I only describe it. It's like I don't know if it's like a uh, maybe it's because it's connected to the camera that I use, but it, it's like a gain increase on on certain low points. So it creates this like <sighs> kind of sound, and I and I'm like literally having to go through and take just that and drop the level so you don't hear it. <laughs> that might just be, that might just be my beard no, if I turn to like rubbing. No, it, and so. I I thought at first maybe <laughs> one of us was brushing 
you know, but no, because I because Peter does that to me on Retro Movie Geek and Terror of the Two. His big old beard gets on his uh, uh, earbuds. That's that's a different sound. It's a crunchier sort of sound. No, this is something else. But that's the kind of stuff that annoys me. But that being said, annoyances aside, and try trying to gradually improve and get better as we go. Uh, because the other mm-hmm. thing to add is, yes, I may have had a micro budget filmmaking background, but that was like 20 plus years ago. So I'm I'm having to get back on the horse. I'm getting back in the deep end of the pool, as it were. Um, but that being said, I love doing that, too. Like, to me, this doesn't feel like work either. Like, it's just fun. I, I, get, yeah. I get to hang out with my buddy, talk about movies and crap I love. And then I get to edit, which has always been my favorite part of the process anyway. So. Uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm having a blast. And I, as long as everybody out there is enjoying it, and we're again trying to get better as we go along, improve production quality. We we also other got some other things. I know I want to um, do some um, kind of like horrors, hollowed grounds, like Sean Clark does videos, of, but not necessarily just horror. But in our, I know in our neck of the woods, we've had several movies that were shot, and so we we're going to try to put together some maybe longer form videos where we actually go around to the locations and share yeah. those with you and see what they look like today, that kind of thing. Um, obviously, unboxing videos, uh, yeah, stuff like that. Just you know, and whatever people like, that's what we'll do more of. So yeah, uh, thank you is is the main thing to say. Thank you very much. We really want you to know we do appreciate your time and attention to any of this. You know, a lot of you have been here since the beginning. I know, I know a handful of you are old school friends of mine and Tyson's that we've known forever and a day, but we appreciate you guys supporting us as well. Cause let's be frank, you guys put up with us for a good chunk of our lives and we wouldn't blame you. If you didn't want to yeah. watch videos <laughs> exactly. of us as well. So we appreciate everybody, whether you be somebody I, we've known since we were 11 years old, like in the case of my buddy, JL, uh, or if you're somebody who literally found out about us yesterday and you're like, oh, this is kind of cool. I'd like to see more of these goofballs. So we appreciate it. Absolutely. All the shares, all the comments on the, yeah. the videos. Uh, and full disclosure, Joel handles most of those eh. as, as well. I chime in every every once in a while. But, uh, um, you know, I certainly I, I do read every one of them that, uh, that comes through. So, yeah. So we appreciate it. We appreciate all of you. And uh, here's to us getting to a thousand. So if you aren't already subscribed, please do, because that just helps the channel out and helps a couple of schlubs who are trying to keep the uh, sort of physical media video store era experience going along with so many other people, by the way, that do that. And we yeah. are. Well, at some point, I actually want to start doing a spotlight on all the different people that do this kind of work. Because I think it's important. I honestly think it's awesome. People who yeah, want to keep this going. I didn't even realize it. Uh, definitely not to the the level now. Uh, a year ago, I guess is what I'm trying to say is I didn't realize that we were part of such a. Uh, you know what? Cult is a good word for it. Mm-hmm. The uh, sort of the 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 underground physical media. Yeah. Um, uh, low budget analog sort of sort of yeah. cult i mean i knew yeah. that that was making a comeback but uh the, you know that's the other thing i'm thankful for is not only the subscribers but some of the friends and contacts and yes other creators yep that we've met 100 in the last year it's uh, yeah it's really awesome that's so. been one of the coolest things about this too yeah you're right it's getting to meet all these cool people and and uh, yeah man it's awesome so it's fun and we appreciate it we appreciate you and uh stay tuned for more mom and pop video shop and remember until we meet again at mom and pops our love of you knew i was gonna do this <laughs> yep uh scooby-doo the original oh of complete course. series oh very nice that's a cool box nice isn't that cool yeah and you know pops. what else you know what else never stops ever mom and pops